Hello everyone, welcome to this new video on the CBCT basics. In this video, we'll see what are the three different sections that we get in the DICOM file of the CBCT and how to orient them. Let's see the video. So this is what you get when you open the DICOM file that you receive from your CBCT center. Here we can see three different sections and the 3D reconstruction. This one is axial section. This is coronal and this one is sagittal section and this one is the 3D reconstruction of the image. So for easy understanding in this 3D reconstruction, you can see three wireframes, a yellow one, the purple one and the greenish one. All right. So this yellow one that you are seeing is dividing the structure into two parts, the upper one and the lower one. All right. So it will divide the structure into upper and lower or the superior and inferior part. And the section that we get through this is axial section. All right. As you can see this frame, this yellow frame as we move up and down here, as we move up and down in the axial section, you can see the image changing. So it is basically showing us the internal anatomy at the point where this yellow wireframe is. And as we go up and down, you can see the internal anatomy of the structure in the axial section. All right, here you can see the roots, the bone, the cortical plate, all these things are visible in the axial section. All right, as you can see here, this is the crown part, the crown, the yellow line is in the crown level, right? As we go down, you can see the crown is now, now we are entering into forcation area. Now you can see the two roots have separated and we are going down. At the same time, we can see different root canals of those particular tooth as well. All right. So these things can be seen in the axial section. Now, if you see the next wireframe, the one which is purple in color. Now this purple color wireframe is dividing the structure into two parts, the anterior part and the posterior part or you can see front and back. As you can see, it is dividing it into front and back and at that point, if you cut the structure, that section that you can see here, you, get, you are getting here, this section is known as coronal section. As you can see this purple wireframe, as we are moving it from back to front, at the same time in coronal section, you can see the structures changing, right? So it is dividing the structure into front and back and at that particular point when you cut the anatomical structure, what thing you are going to see inside from front view? That is the coronal section or you can also call it as frontal section. All right. So here you can see as this purple line is moving from front and back, you can see the buccal and lingual part of the bone and the internal anatomy of the tooth is also visible. Now the third wireframe, the green wireframe that we see here, it is dividing the structure into right and left part or you can say the medial and the lateral part. At that point, if you cut the structure, what internal anatomy that we are going to see is this one, the sagittal section. So as you can see here, as we are moving the green wireframe from buccal to lingual or from lateral to medial, at the same time, you can see structures visible at that particular point. The internal anatomy at that particular point in sagittal section is visible here. You can see the buccal bone and as we go medially, you can see this inferior now running through. Right. Next, as we go more medially, you can see presence of the tooth here. Yes, you can see the anatomy of the tooth. Here you can see the mental foramen as well. Right. So this thing is visible in the sagittal section. So this is the basic idea about three different sections that we get in the CBCT. In our next video, we'll see what are the indications of each section and how we can use it for our different indications like implant planning in the endodontic cases, for the cases of impacted teeth, for the cases of maxillary sinus and others. Thank you for watching the video. Let me know if you have any queries in the comment section and also let me know if you want to know about any particular thing about using the CBCT. If you find this video helpful, like it, share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel.